I'm going to share with you inshaAllah ta'ala, especially the young people in the audience. You don't have something called free time, guys. You don't. You are, you are members of this ummah. Any member of this ummah, especially the young member of this ummah, is constantly working to make his society better. To do something good for people. You don't have free time. You don't have time to play video games for 8 hours. You don't have time for Grand Theft Auto. You don't have time for modern warfare. You don't have time. You don't have time for the new movie that's coming out. You don't have time for Superman. You don't have time. You have time to do more important things. That your, your youth of this ummah, hold yourself to a higher standard. Not just because the elders are telling you, because the shaykh is telling you, because somebody else is telling you. Because your own conscience should tell you. Your la ilaha illallah should tell you, man. It should tell you that you have to be active people. That you will see corruption around you in society. You'll see youth that are getting away from Allah. Who do you think will invite them? Me? No, they don't. Those kids that don't come to the masjid. Those kids that don't come to any halaqat. I have no way of reaching them. You have to reach them. You know, they're your friends. They hang out with you, not with me. You got to go to them. You have to be their dua. You have to be an inspiration to them. So you have to make sure that you, you become a person of concern for those around you. Your friends, don't just complain about your friends. Man, my friends, all they do is watch movies, this and that. Have you ever advised them? Have you ever given them something more positive to do instead? Have you been a good influence for them? You know, this is what you have to do. May Allah Azza wa Jal make our youth the leaders of this ummah. And may Allah Azza wa Jal make, make them role models for others who have gone away from Allah to bring them closer to Allah Azza wa Jal. May Allah make all of you examples, good examples of Islam. So the non-Muslims who come to this country, they just see you and they say, man, I want to be Muslim. I want to be like that guy. I want you to be like that. That's the character you live by. Your honesty, your integrity, the way you carry yourself, the respect you show to others. You know, they just see that and they say, man, I want to be a Muslim. These Muslims have something special. This is what you have to become. Don't, don't think you're going to give da'wah to non-Muslims by handing them a pamphlet, or giving them a website, or showing them a video. The real da'wah to Islam is the character of a Muslim. It's the character of a Muslim. You are the du'at of Islam without even opening your mouth. Especially here, when you have guests coming, when you have non-Muslims coming, and they're observing the Muslims. And they don't think that it's Muslims. They're not going to say Islam is great, but the Muslims are messed up. They're not going to think like that. They're going to think Islam is messed up. Because they, whatever they see you doing, they think that's Islam. So whatever you're doing, no matter when you're doing it, you are ambassadors of Islam. Allah will ask you and me on Judgment Day, this is what you showed to those who were coming to Islam? Were you the reason they came close to Islam? Or were you the reason they went even further away from Islam? SubhanAllah. The responsibility that rests on our shoulders. May Allah Azza wa give us the ability to carry that responsibility and become responsible members of this beautiful ummah.